So with a lot of AAA games, I can't speak about Spider-Man and Wolverine specifically, but I'll take God of War Ragnarok, for example. I want to say there are 40 different missions in that game um, and that not all of them occur depending on your choices. Um, but there are so many more like if each if each mission is a chapter in a book there are so many more missions in a game than there are chapters in my books um mainly because I write YA and I like kind of longer chapters 10 to 15 pages um but when I'm outlining the process is also very different for that very reason so outlining for me looks like making a bulleted list of all of my scenes and then in each bullet I include um what has to happen in the scene for it to be critical to the story and then the hook that keeps the reader turning the page at the end, like the, the, the big question, the pivot um, from John York's book. Um, and if I don't have one of those in the bullet, it's not complete. It's not a complete chapter. It's not a complete concept. And I have work to do before I can get started writing. Um, and then I color code them by exposition, rising tension, the, where the climax is, the resolution, um, so that I know that, uh, the, yeah, exposition, inciting incident, rising tension, uh, climax, and resolution. So that I know generally what the pacing is. Most of my books end up being rising tension. Um, the middle is like the, the chunky part. Um, but with games, oftentimes the main story thread is determined by leadership. And then writers come in and write the individual missions. Um, so there's a lot less like storyboarding that happens at all levels and it, that's more that more happens at the top and then writers come in and we write individual sections um, but scene by scene like if I'm writing an entire mission I'll then you know outline that in much the same way just making sure I have a beginning a middle and an end and know where in the scene the pivot is and what makes it feel like a different game at this point what what changes the story direction in the middle um in gaming it's also called a reversal um which is more dramatic it's, it's where like in the middle of the mission a new piece of information will come on the scene and it completely reverses what the character was initially or what the player was initially trying to do um so yeah they're similar and different 